It was developed at the same time as the Frontier Project. Gale didn't trust Nevek, so he performed the operation behind their backs. We never figured out exactly what caused him to lose faith, but my husband and I both trusted Gale and agreed to the operation. In the end, my husband died along with Gale because of Solotov's backstabbing. Are you positive he betrayed you? Yes. Solotov was the only one that knew the location of the Frontier Project facility. I'm sure Gale mentioned that, too. I wonder... Was the information about Ivan Solotov just another Nevek lie? Why do you think that? Just a hunch. It looks like we need to do a little more investigation into this. Your harmonizer. It feels like the key to something important, but... But? Well, it was frozen without thermal energy for 30 years. That had a terrible effect on its operating ability. I'm so sorry to interrupt your pleasant chat. Joe found us a route. Whenever you're ready, we can head out. Come in, please. <laughs> Hold on. What was that about 30 years? Gail's death. It's been 30 years. I first came to this world 10 years before that. What? What are you talking about? The power to delay the aging process. I was buried under a mountain of ice for 30 years before Yuri found me. It's time for us to go our separate ways. Basil. Thank you. Woo. Yeah. There's been a total of three games. I didn't play two because it was multiplayer only. Well, you could play it technically by yourself, but it wasn't really doable. Um, but yeah, I played like one and three. I don't really remember much about three. <laughs> I do plan on playing it on the stream, so I, you know, when it comes to the Lost Lost Planet franchise, I am playing definitely this one, finishing this one today, and then sometime in the future, re re revisiting three since it is on uh, PlayStation Plus. Checking that out, and um, yeah, I mean, I. I guess the reason why maybe Capcom hasn't really revisited this is probably because 3 didn't do as well as it, they wanted it to. Yeah, I, I really don't remember 3 that much. So, I think 3 was a totally different type of game comparatively. I remember playing multiplayer a lot, though. Apparently, multiplayer was my jam. Because, if I remember correctly, multiplayer had the whole node system of capturing the thermal, uh, thermal, uh, you know, little nodes and everything like that. You pretty much, it was almost like, uh, I wouldn't say it was like, Kind of like had some influences of Battlefield in a way, where you had to capture one section to another. Oh yeah, I love uh, third-person shooters. <laughs> it's always been my jam. Third-person shooters, baby. Get some more ammo. Can't see, but I'm shooting. Oh my god, they did some damage. I 
Yeah. <clears throat> I do remember this game being slightly difficult, though. <laughs> and I was like, yep, replaying this game again. It's gotten pretty hard. That's how Capcom games used to be. Just still kind of are, though. Some, some of the uh, newer Capcom, like... Like Resident Evils and all that, like they're flexibly difficult. Like if you, you make the game as hard as you want it to be. <laughs> Ready. All right. So where the hell am I going? I want to go over there. Yeah. <laughs> Capcom always kind of kept that ideal of, hey, you know what? We're known for really hard, extremely difficult games. Let's kind of keep that. take it if I can get in it all right we have a laser Vulcan and a cannon that is all I can have then I think it yeah it can transform Let's see if I can even traverse this. I'm gonna have to transform again. Oh, okay, there's ground. Oh shit! Oh, he's dead. He's so dead. And yeah, this game is loud as fuck too. <laughs> Can I destroy that? Go at the... No, I can't. I don't even know if I can, uh... Might be able to go around. I might be able to go around. See if I can go around. Oh, that looks promising. Whoa, shit. The shit. The fucker had some health on him. Oh, shit. It's another reason why, like, people fell in love with Souls like games. I think a lot of people miss that difficulty spike that they had with uh, retro games. It's a plasma gun. I do plasma gun. I'm trying to transform. There we go. Liza P. Yeah, I played a little bit of that. It was good from what I played. Oh shit. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm so dead. <laughs> Nope. <laughs> Boom. Shit, 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 shit. Ah, shit. 
shit! <laughs> oh, he's transforming. Oh, I'm so... I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Fuck. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. <laughs> oh my god, this guy. <laughs> Fuck. No! Don't you dare. <laughs> Holy shit. Is he dead? Oh, thank God. <coughs> I'm playing on the Switch. Fortnite. Seeing it. Yeah, I need to. I need to. Oh shit! I need to get some thermal <laughs> before I freeze to death. Yeah, I need to eventually build a new PC. So I'm still using the PC that I was using years ago. Oh, oh, oh no, 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 oh, get down. There we go. Holy hell. That was so fucked up. <laughs> yeah, with the PC I need to build, I pretty much need to build a whole new PC from like the ground up. So everything's just so old. I can't just replace one part and say, okay, I'm good. Nope. Everything is as old as fuck. Man, I need a freaking mech. I don't think this is doable without one. Uh, I can only have the EM laser or... I'm so screwed. I'm so screwed. Oh, I'm so screwed. <laughs> Without a mech? Oh my god. This isn't doable. Are you shitting me? Oh, got him. Oh, hopefully that's a mech I can ride. Please tell me that's a mech I can equip. Cause I need it. <laughs> I need a new mech. Turn out Lethal Company. I'm trying to remember if I have. No, I don't think I have actually. It's, it's a multiplayer game, right? Boom, bitch. Dude. I don't know if this is, I don't know if this is doable. Did he fall in the lava? Oh, snap. Oh, no. That, I thought that was a mech for me, but I guess not. Oh, 
might just be able to cheese him. Just shoot him with rockets. Am I hitting him? I think I'm hit. Yeah, I got him. Yeah, I think I know I think Bevo talked about it. I don't know if it was Bevo or Cody. I haven't I haven't been playing a lot of multiplayer games over these past few years though. I should play more. I just don't have people to play with. So I've been mainly focusing on uh, console games past few years. Oh, he's not dead. Oh, he's not dead. Because uh, I know Cody's been active and I think yeah, Beavis has been kind of doing his own thing. Just chilling, <laughs> from what I remember. Alright, is that... I really... Okay, that's a new VR... VS I can... take over. Yes! New VS! Why are they dying so easily? The shit? Oh, there's a boss fight. That's why. Oh no. This boss fight looks like shit too. Ah, fuck off. <laughs> no, I need more rocket launchers. Ooh, backside's this weak point. Uh... No! <laughs> there we go. Jeez, these... These fights are so chaotic. Uh oh. Ooh. Oh, the ground is falling apart. Well, I'm out of ammo. Time to switch VS's. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm not doing any damage to him. God, oh my god. I need it. I need a new weapon, man. Rocket launcher, there we go. Screw your... Oh, drill, drill, drill! <laughs> Uh-oh. All right. Boom. Ooh. 
Come on. Is he almost dead? <laughs> He's dead. Ah, those, those fights are so chaotic. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I would, I would like to play more multiplayer games with people. But, you know, due to the fact there's so many multiplayer games out there, I don't know what people are playing, if I want to play them, if I have time to play them. <laughs> All the things. You've done a fine job. One man destroying this whole facility. No ordinary man could pull that off. Something's wrong. I don't read any signs of life in the area. Who are you? The name's Dennis Eisenberg. I oversee Nethic's operation on this planet. And you are? Wayne. A perfect world free of the acreage. The Frontier Project is what will shake the colonists of this planet free from that horrible nightmare. Half a century. Fifty years is a long time. Some decided to abandon our dream and become the lawless snow pirates. It was our fault for letting it happen. Our lenience with them was our undoing. But at the time, we felt a certain duty to our former comrades. There were exceptions if they would have just gone merrily on their way and stayed out of our business then we wouldn't have had any problems but they didn't and thus they had to pay the price with their lives on occasion it's never easy to kill someone you felt close to at one time so you killed my father your father me my father's goal was to bring an end to the Frontier Project. So, you're Gale's boy. What a sad end! I wanted Gale to come around and understand my dream. Then together, together we could have achieved it. How about this? Did you find something? It's faint, so it's hard to get a response. But this? Gail isn't here, but I at least want you to see where I'm coming from. We have so much catching up to do. I'm sure we can reach an understanding. Just like you and Yuri reached one? Hey, look at this. What is it? I'm not registering a life sign from that guy. Wayne! Rick found something. His contributions have propelled our efforts light years ahead. <sighs> he was truly a genius. Was. Don't jump to conclusions now. I haven't killed him or anything. Too bad. Looks like we won't be coming to any understandings today. Next. Next. Uh... Hey, we can't just sit around here doing nothing. We all want to be doing something, anything, but we don't have any clue where to go next. We don't even know what Nevik is up to. Or 
what Yuri is up to. There is still one lead available. This place might be worth checking out. These are the canyons. Right. We passed through these canyons before. But there's also a subterranean area down below. Huh? What do you mean? Well, depending on the filters you lay on it, a map can reveal more than it does at first glance. And right here, it's well hidden. But there's a sizable thermal energy deposit in the lower canyon area. A deposit? Five years ago, a processing plant down there was shut down and abandoned for some reason. There's enough thermal energy there to supply Nevik for years. If it's been left untouched this whole time, it'll provide a good jump start for the Frontier Project. It's just a hunch. But if your hunch is right... Wayne, let's check it out. Yeah. Ooh, mission nine. All right, let's see what crazy shenanigans are. Or we won't be going anywhere. So, I'm playing this on the PS5, and I wish there was some type of like I don't know FPS boost. <laughs> this you know, goes under 30 frames per second. Very hard to play that. <laughs> yeah, I think. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Oh, 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 oh. I wonder if I could just blow his tower up. Oh. That doesn't kill him. I don't know what will. Yeah, I'm pretty much. I have. I still have my physical copy for the Xbox 360 for this game. But um, oh, I should really kill that guy. God, that guy doesn't want to die. But I, I think it's still in storage. So I'm kind of streaming it through the PS5 right now. The actual streaming games directly to your console, at least PlayStation-wise, is not bad. They just don't do anything to improve like older games, like certain frame rates. Like a good amount of the PS3 games tend to be a little, you know low on frame rate <laughs> I don't know if the servers are still up I haven't tried I don't think they are I think Capcom shut them down years ago I'm not too sure though <laughs> just depends on if Capcom has them up pretty sure they shut them down Way, way long ago. Oh, holy shit! Okay, that's not cool. Let's see if I can. Oh, no, 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 no. Holy shit. Cool thing is with the plasma gun, 